Now if you've got some wooden utensils that you need to keep from splitting, whether you're finishing a tamper, a muddler, this is for a hot chocolate in South America, it's wooden spoons, here's another version of a muddler, or butcher blocks is my go-to product. Unsponsored, and you can see we use it a lot because we've drain the bottle down. It's Howard Butcher Block Conditioner. It's food safe. We actually have a sock or you can, any kind of cotton cloth and you can just take your dry, fresh acacia wood and you don't need to use a glove. I mean this is all food safe so it's good but I just use it for like this and then put some on and there you go. If you're going to use this for sauerkraut, you probably want to condition it once, let it sit overnight, condition it again in the morning, and then after a couple hours, any extra residue you can just wipe off with a paper towel or something like that. This is really easy to use and works great conditioner for any kind of wood products in your kitchen. There's a spoon we haven't done for a while, I'll just do this. You can use olive oil and I've used that in the past. But this Howard Woodblock Conditioner, again, totally unsponsored, is just that good. And you can see, you can just do all your wood stuff at the same time. And it just takes seconds to get the job done. You know, you can see how much I'm putting on. It won't leave an aftertaste or anything or impact your food whatsoever. Just like on the cutting board. And I just put it in the bag and zip it up, take the air out, put these side by side. Sometimes you can even put a rubber band around them and they're ready for next time. A couple seconds of rubbing down these tampers with the conditioner makes all the difference in the world on keeping this acacia wood functional and ready to go every time you need to use it when you're making sauerkraut, kimchi, whatever it is. Thumbs up and comments, always appreciate it. Thanks for watching. If you're interested in quick kitchen tips, making and breaking things, designs of all kinds, home repairs, I even do costumes, cosplay, and props. Check out my channel and please subscribe because you never know what you're gonna see.